In this video, I'm sharing all essential items you will need before taking your new puppy home. Essential items meaning you must have those things or else things might not work out with your new puppy. Everything mentioned in the video is also listed under the description box below. So head down there and use it as a checklist to see if you have everything you need to welcome your new best friend. If this is your first time here, welcome to my channel where we share Shiba Inu training tips and tricks and also funny life with dogs videos. Subscribe to get all the tips you need to raise a happy dog. Now, without further ado, let's get right to it. Crate and or playpen. When you first introduce your new puppy home, there are a lot of things for him to learn and get used to. It is always a good idea to have him start in a confined area first. I listed both the crate and playpen together because they serve similar purpose. If you're only getting one of those, I recommend you get a playpen because playpen can serve as his home and also it can use as a confined play area for your new puppy. When Jimmy was young, we attach his crate to the playpen and after a few weeks, we remove the crate and only use playpen when we need to place him in a dog-proof space and we place his bed in the playpen area directly. Food Your puppy needs high-quality puppy food in order to supply his rapid growth need. I don't recommend you choose grain-free or any special diet for your new dog unless there is an underlying health reason for you to choose a specific diet. Puppy food compared to adult food has more dense nutritional component. It is higher in protein, fat, and minerals. It is also higher in calories. Take a close look at the ingredients list and make sure you can understand at least the first five ingredients on the food label so you know what you're feeding your dog. Food and water bowl. Following for the quality puppy food, you are going to need container to feed him. When selecting your puppy's food container, think about how you want your dog's area to look like in the long term. This is a personal choice because there literally have hundreds of dog food balls options out there. Consider what kind of materials fit your need. Are you looking for unbreakable stainless steel? Or maybe you opt for a glass material or even ceramic that fits your unique taste. Harness, collar, and leash. When you take your dog out for walks, you need mechanism to prevent him running wild. I know some dog trainers would recommend collar over harness for leash training purpose, but we have been using harness the whole time when we have Jimmy, and it's been working well for us. So select either harness or collar. They will both serve the purpose for walks. For the leash option, select a simple nylon, non-retraceable leash for easier leash training and control. Toys. I am including toys as essential items because other than taking your dog to the walks, you need to keep them occupied and entertained. Toys are a great way for you to build bond and train your dog. Here are a few types of toys that you should have handy. Chewing toys. Between week 12 to up to 6 months is when your puppy replacing puppy teeth with adult teeth. He is going to need to chew on things. Make sure you get some high quality durable chewing bones or toys for your puppy. I will list a few products we use in the description box if you want to check them out. Squeaky toys. 
Squeaky toys are interactive and great ways for you to bond with your dog while playing with him. We used to get a bag of dozen squeaky toys, and Jimmy loves them. Keep in mind that typically those toys don't last long, and you should always monitor your puppy while he plays, in case he accidentally swallow the parts he's not supposed to. Self-entertain toys, IQ toys. Those are the toys where you can hide treats within it and have your dog play with it himself, or you can leave the toy with him while you're away to keep him entertained. We used to use cone, and it is so versatile that we can literally hide anything within it and let Jimmy hunt for the treats. Cone is one of the few toys. That we have since Jimmy was a puppy, and we still use it now when he's grown up. The health stuff, vat microchip vaccine. Research a reputable vet and make an initial appointment once you receive your new puppy. On your first visit, check if your dog is microchipped, and you also want to do a full body checkup. Including blood work, discuss the required vaccine in your state, and potentially deworming medication if applicable. You should also discuss with your vet if it is necessary to put your dog on any heartworm prevention, flea and tick prevention, and later on inquire about neuter timing and preparation with your vet. So now you have it. The essential must-have items for your dog. I do plan to make a separate video for the extended items you should have for your dog, so stay tuned for the follow-up video. If you like to see more content like this, remember to like and leave me a comment below to let me know. The best way to support the channel is by clicking on any one of the videos listed on the screen. And I added the one you might be interested in. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time.